Good morning, Lakeside. Please stand for the pledge. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, April 16, 2019. I'm Maya here with Ariana, and we would like to welcome you back to another great day at Lakeside Middle School. Let's start today out with a few messages from Mr. Parker. Good morning, Lakeside, and happy Tuesday. I am here by myself today. Mr. Stewart had some business he needed to take care of, but we are moving forward with recognizing the best of the best from Lakeside Middle School. And as always, we have two students of the day. Let's give them a big round of applause. Oh. Two people in the studio. Slim Pickens over here this morning. All right, our very first student is Mr. Kobe Easton, and Mr. Kobe Easton is being recognized by Mr. Coots. And this is what Mr. Coots had to say about Kobe. Kobe is a kind-hearted individual that is always eager and willing to help out others. I enjoy talking with Kobe not only about academics but also with sports. It has been a pleasure to watch Kobe grow and mature over the last two years. I know that Kobe will achieve great. Uh, tasks in his future, and I am proud of the scholar he is. Keep up the excellent work. That's very nice. Congratulations, Kobe, for a job well done. And we have some candy bars. They just arrived. They'll be in my office, so afterwards I will make sure that they get theirs. And also being recognized by Mr. Coots is Damara Lopez. Let's give your a break of applause in the studio. How you doing, Damara? Good. Doing good? Okay. This is what Mr. Coots had to say about Damara. Damara has really applied herself this year and is at grade level in all of her classes. Awesome. She works very hard and is a perfectionist. Damara has really made school a focus and a priority this year. I'm proud of Damara and, and her accomplishments this year. I know she's going to be successful on the goals that she has set for herself. So there you go, Damara. Congratulations. Good job. And again, reminder, students, you too could be here um, doing well in your classes. Maybe kind of tap your teacher, give them a little reminder, say I'm doing well. Say you want to be student of the day and you just might be up here. Also, a couple things, uh, students. Tomorrow's a big, big day is iReady Diagnostic Test in your ELA, your English classes. So make sure you're ready to go in English because you will be taking some diagnostic assessments. And then even better news, uh, this weekend is a four-day weekend. Good Friday, off for four days, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, and we come back on Tuesday. Also, students, we're gonna send, uh, let your uh, parents know, we'll send out a dialer that tomorrow school is out at 12, I believe. Uh, it's a core day. Teachers are gonna be doing some staff development. Also a reminder for you teachers. Um, so the classes will be just a little bit shorter, I believe, and we will be ending, uh, we will have dismissal at 12 o'clock. So that's all I have. Uh, we have students over here celebrating with the good news, <laughs> doing a little dance. And uh, that's all we have. Back to the students. Have a wonderful day. Thank you, Mr. Parker, and congratulations to the students of the day. Tomorrow, we want to remind you that we will be taking our ELA iReady Diagnostic. Our goal is to improve our score from the mid-year diagnostic. The language art department would like you to know that if, you, if your score improves from your mid-year diagnostic, 20 more books will be deposited into your bank account. Your teacher also may have some extra credit opportunities for you if your score increases as well. Remember that this score will be used as your elective placement for next year. So if you'd like to keep the elective you choose, give it your all on your ELA end of the year diagnostic. And remember you will need earbuds or headphones so come prepared. I'd like to repeat that important information. You will need your earbuds or headphones so please come prepared. Also don't forget that we are in the middle of our March for March of Dance fundraiser. Dig in those couches and under the seats of your parents' car and donate today. Saturday steam papers are now available. If you and your friend turn in a permission slip together, you will both receive 10 Robux. And then another 10 when both of you arrive that Saturday. Please make sure you have your ID, passport, a charge Chromebook, and earbuds on you every day. The best way to stay up to date on the events and information on campus, please follow us on Instagram and Twitter at LakesideVVUSD. Bye, Lakeside, and don't forget to be respectful, organized, accountable, and responsible. Roar!